Welcome back, everybody, to the Hofkast, where we're in the creepiest part of the Elite Four with Agatha. I hear Oak's taken a lot of interest in you, child. That old Duff was once tough and handsome, and he... Oh, I rode him like a stallion, but that was decades ago. He's a shadow of his former self. Now he just wants to fiddle with his diddle. I mean his Pokedex. He's a fool. Pokemon are for battling. I'll show you how a real trainer battles. Wow, that's an angry old woman who uh, has some sort of old connection to Professor Oak. I mean, I ain't... Hey, man, that's between you two. Um, that is not a ghost. I forgot that she has snakes. Why does she have snakes? <laughs> um, all right. Mega Charizard Y, destroy this, this, this wretched abomination. Arbok, what a boring Pokemon. You see, this is, this is what I mean, like, so a lot of people are like kind of criticizing like, oh, like, some of the new designs for like, Pokemon in the, in the, oh no. Come on. How the hell does glaring at me make me paralyzed? Um... Damn, I really thought I'd be able to one one shot this stupid snake. When people are like criticizing like the new Pokemon designs and being like, oh like they're so uncreative, yada yada yada. Um, it's like, oh look, it's a set of keys, or like, oh it's a it's a piece of ice cream. I'm just like, I mean you're not wrong. But Ekans and Arbok are literally just snakes. There's nothing creative about them. They're literally just snakes. Whereas like okay, like Weezing, right? He's a ball of gas. Like, that's interesting. Like, it's like it's not a real thing that you can find and oh, oh, baby. Get wrecked. <laughs> like, that's not something you can find in real life. Like a ball of floating gas with two heads, right? Or like, or like a ghost that looks like this. You know, like these are interesting Pokemon. But then like, I don't know. Like, I don't, I don't have, I don't take issue with certain Pokemon's designs. From the new games like i'm just like yeah like they just had an idea and they did it like magnemite's just based off a magnet in the same way that like any other kind of pokemon can come into existence it's just like ekans and arbok are literally just snakes like that's it there's nothing they're not like oh this is like a an electric snake or this is like a a, a fire snake that and, and instead of teeth it has coal um, and it and it injects magma instead of poison, right? Like that sounds like an interesting Pokemon idea, but no, Ekans and Arbok are literally just snakes, just straight up snakes, which is fine. No, no, I got greedy. No, I have to revive my Charizard now. Um, all right, Pikachu, you can finish it off, I'm sure. Um, but yeah, look, look at Pikachu. He's he's a rat. Right? Or, or a mouse. But it's like, oh, but he's an electric mouse. Which is like, fair enough. Like, Blastoise is a turtle, but he's like a water turtle that can turn into something that eventually has cannons coming out of his back that shoot water. And it's like, cool. But, I don't know. Just in defense of the newer games, like, there's a lot to appreciate about them. And I think the criticisms of some of the newer designs of Pokemon, you know, like, like, okay, Golbat and Zubat. Z they're both just bats, but at least Zubat's like a blind bat. Like he's actually blind. He doesn't have eyes. And then turns into this thing that's like this giant flying mouth, essentially, you know? Like, it's just interesting um, to consider because people complain so much about like these newer Pokemon, but I, I disagree with a lot of the criticisms. Um, Anyway, that was Agatha, um, the first Elite Four member to take down one of my Pokemon. Um, I will give her props for that. Damn. Um, Alright, and the last member of the Elite Four will be Lance, the Dragon Master. Which means his first Pokemon will be a... If I remember correctly, it's going to be a Gyarados. Come here. Oh, he's standing there with his Dragonite. What is up? Oh, we're in the last room. So, you're Roscosity. I lead the Elite Four. You can call me Lance, the Dragon Trainer. 
You likely know that dragons are Pokemon spoken of in legends. They're hard to catch and raise, but their powers are superior. They're virtually indestructible, except for the fact that they have really low defense and special defense. There's no being clever with them. Hello, Dragonite. Are you ready to lose? Your Pokemon League challenge ends with me, Roscosity. High five! <laughs> All right. Oh, listen to that music. Uh, a Seedra? That's... Wait, no, it used to be two, two Gyarados to start with. It was like Gyarados, Gyarados, Aerodactyl, Dragonair, and Dragonite, I'm pretty sure. But anyway, get out of here, Seedra. Get wrecked. I guess, like, Seedra is, it's in the Pokedex. I think its entry says it's the Dragon Pokemon. But, like, in actual, okay, uh, Aerodactyl, which means Articuno should blow this dude out of the sky. Except for the fact that my Articuno is really weak, so we'll see if Articuno can do it. See, you're talking about, like, oh, Dragon Drop spoken of in Legends. And I'm like, well, here's some actual legendary Pokemon. What do you got to say to you? What do you got to say to that, boy? All right, here we go. Blizzard, Blizzard, Blizzard. No! No! Oh, God. Damn it! Oh, I forgot that it's rock type. Okay, I didn't forget it was rock type. I just forgot that rock type was super effective against a flying type. Damn it. So he's like super effective against me, but I like ice is also super effective against flying and again. Oh, d damn it. All right, let's let's mega evolve and destroy this guy. All right, come here. Come on, Blastoise. Look at you go. Ooh, go you good thing. I should have taught my Blastoise Ice Beam, actually, so that he can damage multiple people at once. Like, as in multiple types, not multiple people. Come on, Hydro Pump. Yes! That's a dead bird if I ever seen one. Oh, baby. Um, down you go. Um, Alright, what's next? What's next? Gyarados. Okay, so he still has the Gyarados. He still has it. Um, Alright, Zapdos. Out you come. Um, far out. The blast, dude. The oh, far out. Again, just the the cannon design on the blast is so awesome. Um. Also, by the way, just in reference to what I was saying before, I have nothing against, like, kind of like Pokemon designs that are simple, like Ekans and Arbok. Like, I'm just saying, I think the criticism of the newer generation Pokemon is not founded because there have been quote unquote he has a charizard oh dude we have to finish his charizard with a blastoise then that's that's the way it's got to be um because i mean like you look at like ratata eradicate pidgey uh all that kind of stuff yeah like they're just straight up animals which is fine dude that's so he's using a charizard that's awesome because everyone's always saying, like, Charizard's clearly a dragon, but he's not a dragon type unless you Mega Evolve him into Charizard X. And holy crap, I filled the whole room with water. I hope Lance is okay. The Charizard's fainted, but Lance is... Dude, Lance, are you drowning? <laughs> Alright, Dragonite. Um, let's, just keep, let's just keep Blastoise out, because Blastoise should... Unless the Dragonite knows Thunder, Blastoise should be fine. Um, let's use Hydro Pump, baby. Come on, most powerful move. Most powerful move. Damn it! Oh, it's not very effective. No! Oh, shoot. This is gonna hurt. Oh, dude, that was... Okay, uh, bite him. Maybe this will be more effective? Nope, not at all. Um, oh, jeez. No, I'm sorry, Blastoise. Oh, okay, well, Agatha knocked out one of my Pokemon, and Lance knocked out two. That's... that's fine. Um, let's see if Pikachu can finish this off. My loyal and most trusted companion. My girl from the beginning. Come here, Pikachu. Um, use Thunder. And don't miss, don't miss, don't miss. Come on. Taking him down? Is this it? Oh, no! All right. Paralyzed though, that's nice. Damage yourself, damage yourself. Yes, yes. All right, come on, don't full restore. Yes. Oh, 
I used to do this all the time, by the way. When I'd be like playing games, like when you reach the end, you have to beat the last person with uh, your starter Pokemon. That's the way I did it. I hate to admit it, but you are a first class Pokemon trainer. Hell yeah, thank you for the $11,000. I still can't believe my dragons lost to you. You are now the Pokemon League champion. Or you would have been, but you have one more challenge left. There is one more trainer to face. That trainer is... P Professor Oak? No, oh, <laughs> I thought I'd have to fight <laughs> Professor Oak. All right, well, next time on the half cast, Let's find out who the Pokemon champion is. Oh, we're so close. <laughs>